BizPortal's weather offers a convenient way to display the weather forecast for various cities. Users can view the weather for one city at a time by selecting it from the location drop-down menu in the web part header. Portal administrators and site owners define the available cities in the configure section. Note that at least one city must be selected for the web part to display data. To change the displayed city, simply select a different location from the drop-down menu at the top of the web part. Additionally, Users can switch between Celsius and Fahrenheit by clicking on the numeric temperature value shown in the web part. Steps to add BizPortal's weather on a modern site or pages and configure it. First, we need to click on the page edit option and then click on plus icon and write BizPortal's weather. Users can configure BizPortal's weather web part as per their requirements. By clicking on the configure button, a side panel will appear. Fill the necessary details. Web part title. This title can be easily adjusted or changed based on your needs. This title can be used to select on the content that is being displayed or the targeted audience that it's for. Web part description. Users can write a brief description which explains the information related to content which has been displayed in the web part. API URL. This field shows the default value of the site from which the weather information is being retrieved. API key. Enter the API key. If the key is incorrect, the BizPortal's weather feature will not function. Configure cities. This feature enables users to add cities that display the weather information of city. Add city. Specify name of the city. External URL. You can use any third-party service to display the weather for the city. Latitude and longitude. These coordinates are used by satellites to locate the city and display its weather information. Obtain them by clicking the click here a link in the next row. Temperature unit. Choose unit of measurement as Celsius and Fahrenheit. Forecast. Choose the number of days to display the weather forecast. Selecting 0 will show only the current conditions, while selecting 1 will show the weather for the next day. Today's forecast. Check this box to display the current day's weather conditions along with the forecast for the number of days selected in the previous field. Set default. Checking this box makes the city the pre-selected option in the web part, displaying its weather by default unless the user selects a different location from the drop-down. Show border. Enable this feature to add a visible border around the web part, enhancing its visual distinction and clarity. Web part layout settings. Select header layout. There are different options to choose from. If you pick the first five options, the header will be displayed. The header will be displayed as shown in options. But if you choose the sixth or seventh option, you can add an image or logo to the header respectively. Select Web Part Layout. Choose Layout from the available options. Web Part Height. Adjust height of web part by sliding the range bar according to the requirement. Display web part title. Enable this button if you want to display the title. Customize theme. Enable this option to personalize the web part's visual appearance by applying a custom background theme. This is achieved by entering adjacent code into the theme editor. Web Part Feedback Settings Specify feedback subject and the recipient's email address to whom feedback-related emails will be sent related to this web part. Thanks for watching the video.